boom shakalaka, Bitcoin is repeating itself exactly to the tune of what could be a quarter million dollar Bitcoin. Today's video, we're going to take a look at exactly what this chart means, plus some really interesting on-chain metrics and when exactly to get scared. You'll definitely want to stay tuned. What's up everyone, Randall here from Crypto Love. Today's video, we're taking a look at Bitcoin, how it is repeating itself exactly, setting up for a quarter million dollar Bitcoin. Oh my gosh. And also, we're going to take a look at some awesome on-chain data. And also, because some people are scared, we're going to take a look at when to actually really get scared. Before we do, guys, make sure just push that like button. It helps out so much. Also, today's the episode is sponsored by Prime XBT, so stay tuned to the end for a sponsored review of the project. Now, it should be no surprise right now why I'm doing a video on this stuff today, where Bitcoin could go, when to actually get scared, because guess what? People are very fearful right now. Even though the prices, well, compared with like a year ago, yeah, they're a lot higher. Well, a little higher, somewhat higher. But still, people are scared because it's down from all-time highs. Could it be a bear market? Could it be the end? Is it all going to crash and burn? Is crypto not a real thing? Well, potentially, we have all these things. Because if we take a look right now, fear, 28%. Yesterday was 25% extreme fear. And if we take a look over time, guys, we are back down into this extreme fearful state. Seems to bounce back and forth. But if we actually take a look at data, this is something that most people don't actually look at. But if you look at data... There's no evidence that we're near the end. Now, granted, it could be the end and we completely miss it, but based on all the data, there's no evidence saying we're at the end. If we take a look at CBI.info, 55% confidence we're at the peak. And as a matter of fact, actually, Bitcoin just kind of follow the, follows the CBI.info trend line right here very nicely. It's probably going to bounce off of it where it is right now. And as you can see on CBI.info, they just recently changed the color now not only that but if we take a look at the bitcoin rainbow price chart sitting pretty right in the middle right in hodl territory this is when you just put on your big boy hodl pants you just relax you don't fomo you watch the markets you relax because you remember you know had you have gotten into bitcoin five years ago you would probably be doing pretty well today well guess what five years in the future is coming up in about five years time and if you just sit in bitcoin and cryptos you're probably going to be good when it comes now that being said, we have some amazing on-chain data from some amazing on-chain analysts. Willie Wu saying here uh, that this Bitcoin supply shock valuation, well, we're currently trading at a very decent discount. Anytime that Bitcoin, the blue line, is underneath the red line, which is a supply shock valuation, well, it's a great time to buy. You can see down here before Bitcoin price went off, down here before Bitcoin price went off, Oh, it didn't happen for a long time, except for down here before the price shot off, down here before the price shot off. So anytime we're below there, great times to buy. However, he does note that it's a model for investors, not traders who can easily be liquidated well before the model plays out. So if you're looking to buy, now is a great time to buy at a discount. And as a matter of fact, it still appears, according to TechTev, like Bitcoin is still on track. As a matter of fact, kind of right in the middle. Not overbought, not oversold, just kind of right in the middle. Same exact thing happened back in the second halving cycle. Same exact thing happened in the first halving cycle. Bitcoin kind of got wedged between this yellow and white line right around, right underneath 1.618 FIB, which is exactly, exactly where we are now. As a matter of fact, in a moment... I'm going to show you exactly how Bitcoin's repeating itself yet again. But, you know, Bitcoin isn't everyone's cup of tea. So for those people, we have some altcoins to look at. You guys know I like using token metrics. As a matter of fact, I just made a video about it a couple days ago, how I particularly use it. One of my favorite ways is just go to analytics, ratings, and then monthly, which gives me the long-term undervalued projects. And just looking at the TM grade, these are some coins you might want to do some research about. Things like Axia Coin or Jarra Coin or Hero or Tor or Crypto Cars or Change Finance or Mirror Shares or 1UP, Google Coin, Ad Shares, Copiosa, Railgun. Now, is this does this mean just go and buy them? No. But this means do research on these projects because if you look, guys, 
These are the top rated coins in all categories on a monthly time frame. If we take a look at the market cap rank now, down in the thousands. So potentially, if this market turns around, these coins have potential to go big, like big, big. So please take some time, do some research, see if any of them are awesome projects, and then you can consider investing some of your own money. Not only that, guys, but another tool in the tool belt, Cointelegraph's Marcus Pro. They just released their recent Vortex report. And if we take a look, the top gainers of the week, they picked out three of the top 10 gaining coins of the week, Luna, WRX, and Hero. Now, you might remember that Hero is also on token metrics as well. So I don't know, maybe go take a look at that one. But if we take a look at the high score table, you can see the top 10 highest scoring coins they had, like Luna, Sys, DDX, Band, VGX, Lit, Cody, KSM, Gno, and Coin. And if we take a look at the top performers, after flagging high on the Vortex score, the price soars. Happened for Terra, happened for Syscoin here, happened for DDX right here, happened for, as a matter of fact, they take the average Vortex score returns, and they can see that uh, within three days, a score of 80 gets 5.4% returns, and 85 gets 10% returns, and a 90 gets 9% returns on average, which is pretty darn awesome returns for a platform. But not only that, you get the news before anybody else with the news quakes, like with Shiba. These news quakes, guess what? Price shot up after that. With Algorand, these news quakes, guess what? Price shot up after that. And so they have all of that there. And if we go and take a look at the dashboard, you can see here, not only they have an awesome Discord community, which I should mention, I don't mention also often enough, but we can see some of the latest news quakes, like Graph offering bug bounty program, like Nexo partnering with Fidelity, like, uh, well, yeah, that partnership with Nexo and Fidelity, but also the scoreboard, some of the coins you might want to go take a look at, things like LF, Ecomi, Wink, Harvest Finance, Alpha Finance House, Origin Trail. Like I said, not saying go out, market, buy these coins, but... Do your research. These are tools in your tool belt. They're not right 100% of the time, but they help get you in the direction you need to go. Which brings us to this chart here, which I think will get us in the direction that we need to go. Because if we take a look back here, October-ish, September, October of 2020, a lot of indecision in the market. People were pretty scared about the markets. As a matter of fact, we had this kind of coil pattern right here. And then once Bitcoin price broke through that coil and bounced off of it, well, guess what? We had this bullish megaphone for months. Bitcoin price went from $10,000 to $65,000, a 6.5x. Well, guys, we have a little bit of a coil pattern right here. We have the middle right here. Well, Bitcoin price breaking out of it, bouncing off of the midpoint. Well, guess what? We have another bullish megaphone Forming Now, granted, it's not as steep as the one previously, but identical, following the pattern previously, just as Bitcoin is following it exactly to a T right here. Guess what? We're in yet another pattern of a different time frame. This one is four-year cycles. This one is actually just in the bull cycle. The beginning of the bull cycle and the end of the bull cycle could potentially launch Bitcoin 6x, quarter million dollars, and... Which brings us to, for all of you guys who just want to be concerned about when the sky is falling, well, this chart here really helps to answer. TechDev says that, basically, if we take a look, the first time with each cycle, the first dip after the first higher high, okay, sets a floor in the two-week RSI, okay? And then we have the bear market confirmation when the RSI actually breaks below that floor that it set happened here in 2013 again first dip after a higher high so we have a higher high dip guess what floor set right here we scan over first time it breaks it was a matter of fact the bear confirmation point right there so if we go and take a look where we are right now we have the first dip after a higher high see higher high first dip floor set well we almost broke through it way back well, i don't know here but that would be the line to watch. If things turn not great, well, that would be the area to watch for Bitcoin. But right now, it looks like Bitcoin is extremely bullish. And as a matter of fact, on an insane discount and probably a lot of good 
altcoins, not shit coins, but good altcoins are on a significant discount at the time. Now, guys, if you did enjoy that, make sure to like. And now on to our sponsored review, Prime XBT. Now, Prime XBT is a platform for trading. They have a copy trading module. They have yield accounts, trading contests. But this is for cryptocurrencies, forex currencies, commodities, stock indices, all trading instruments. And you can see all the tools they have here. Now, it should be said, this is a sponsored review. So clearly, do your own due diligence before investing. This is not an endorsement of the project, but I'm going to go over the project for you. And then you can do your own due diligence and figure out if this is something you'd be interested in investing in. So, Discover a smarter way to trade. Choose among the best performing traders and automatically copy their trading activity. Earn second income by allowing others to follow your trades. So this is probably something that a lot of beginning traders want because they can find out who the best traders are and then they can copy them to a T or experienced traders can actually trade and then you can earn an income by allowing others to copy your trades. It's kind of win-win for everybody. Now, if we take a look, you copy the leading traders in three simple steps. You choose a trader so you can browse through hundreds of trading strategies, review their performance, and choose the most, most suitable one. You can set the amount you're willing to allocate to the selected strategy, and you just click follow. Simple as that. Start following and get the same results as your favorite strategy. You can even follow multiple traders at the same time. Now, just to give you an example, you have a co-vesting copy trading module for Followers. By using the Covest and copy trading module, it allows platform users to browse through hundreds of trading strategies provided by other traders and automatically copy their trading activity. So basically, it would look something like this. You get to see a lot of different traders out there with trading strategies, and you get to see you know, how it's rated in terms of stars, what the total profit has been, how long they've been trading this strategy, their equity, their followers, all types of different stuff. And then you get to choose which strategies you want to follow. It makes trading very easy. And if we go on further, uh, we can see that Covest and Copy Trading Module for Traders, which we just saw there. Now, why? Because it's easy to use, it's powerful, and it's reliable. Now, this Covesting is available on Prime XBT. Covesting itself, powerful tools for wallets exchanging and trading platforms, a fully licensed DLT services provider and software development company. They're building cutting edge solutions and partner with ambitious companies around the world, for instance, like Prime XBT. Uh, B2B software inspired by innovation. We can see wallets, derivatives, exchanges, traditional finance, margin trading, and DeFi, CFI apps. Now they have the Covesting copy trading module that is part of prime xbt their flagship product which allows you to track and automatically copy the trades of other users on the platform and you can see here uh assets active strategies and average returns now that being said there there's also uh building software for tomorrow so flexible by design bulletproof and ever improving but not only that if we take a look at their token the co-vesting token cov token allows holders to enjoy multiple incentive schemes to benefit from the growth of the co-vesting co ecosystem. So uh, you can read the white paper for the COV token there, and you can find out more about the contract address and supply and everything there. But if we scroll down, the token utilities. So it offers a user-centric tokenomics model to provide unique incentive schemes for the members of the co-vesting ecosystem. When locking COV tokens, users are granted uh, advanced premium or elite membership status to offer a wide range of benefits, rewards, and discounts. Such mechanism further supports deflationary nature of, of COV token. So lower fees and higher returns when using it, improved yields, and the burn program. And you can see with the membership, you get either advanced premium or elite. And that brings us to the roadmap they've been working on. So they've been working on a lot of stuff. They've done copy trading, trading module development. They've done B2B partnership product integration, COV token integration, general improvements, risk management improvements, co-vesting yield account developments, and then coming up on the roadmap, more B2B partnerships and product integration, uh, COV membership tiers adjusted, launching COV denominated strategies, launching COV margin trading accounts on Prime XBT, uh, and then in utility, higher profits for followers fo holding COV, higher profits for strategy managers holding COV, 
higher profits for COV denominated strategies, additional protocols for co-vesting yield accounts, improved profit share when the payout currency is COV, improved profit share when the payout currency is COV for strategy managers, and then also earning interest on COV holdings. Now that all being said, it is a coin that you can find on a few different exchanges. If we go and take a look at the markets here, it's available on KuCoin, PancakeSwap, HitBTC, Uniswap, and I'm sure on their own exchange as well. And right now trading at 56 cents, total market cap $10.5 million. And if we take a look at the chart, seems like the chart may have found a little bit of a bottom back here in the beginning of 2020, now starting to tick back upwards. So guys, if that's something that you're interested in, definitely take a look at Prime XBT and also COV token. And thank you very much, Prime XBT, for sponsoring the episode. I will see you guys later. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like. Have a good one. Peace.